we've got. It's picking up a lot of the. Shut off. I got a trick. Damn it! Woo! I'm a big ass. Up the in the footsteps. No. Oh fuck! That one didn't even make it on screen. <laughs> okay. Oh no. That appears to be better. Yeah, What's up, guys? This is the uh, the Dart Podcast. We're actually this doing is, a video cast. We're doing so a video it's cast. Well, uh, you can see us right now. Video cast. Except me, because I'm not standing. I'm actually probably not. Get in the frame. Hey. Hey. There's Riley. I'm here. I want to throw some darts. He was not narrating. I've got the unicorn darts. This is his first throw. Yeah. Yeah, we, we've been, been practicing this whole time, and then Riley's. <laughs> oh, and that shows you how old it went. That probably wasn't even on screen. There we go. All right, cool. Oh, <laughs> So, oh god. <laughs> I'm literally the one that put that there. You know, you think I'd. Oh god. Yeah, we're out here. We're recording a podcast outside. It's beautiful. It's probably going to be very day. windy, and if it is, we're very it's sorry. Great. Yeah, there's going to be a chance of wind sounds. That's <laughs> Austin with the capture. I'm loving it. <laughs> you were talking, and he was like, he's like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was just going, yep, yep. <laughs> just walking along with you. So That's we are on the podcast, I didn't want to say. We finally played our first show, guys. Woo! Yeah. First show. Yeah, we have. Osville's in the books. Yeah, we have not recorded a podcast. <laughs> this one for the second show. Damn it. <laughs> Third one will be better. <laughs> wow, we well, we better just shot quit being a dark. band now. Shot in the dark. Shot in the dark. Yeah, that's right. Uh, oh gosh. Yeah, we are <laughs> recording this like two Sorry, weeks. <laughs> After almost two weeks exactly, yeah, almost two weeks exactly after Hawesville, um, and it was uh, phenomenal. It was absolutely it was, fantastic. It was, it was a long day, um, but it was very fun. Yeah, well, it shouts out to everybody, of course. But Casey and I got there and set up all the shits. My mom helped out. Austin Daniel showed up pretty quickly right after and helped knock everything out. Yeah. Michael, shouts out to Michael. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, Michael's, Michael's been a huge, huge help. Huge help. That was huge. Huge. He already knows I said I told him I'm Michael's buying a t shirt. Also, for all of those listening no, right now, we do officially have Heir to the Crown merch. Yeah, merch coming in. Merch, merch coming, coming in, in right now. This is just the announcement podcast. Yeah. This yeah. is just a huge podcast for all of us. Yeah. This is I'm pretty sure we actually have a podcast on the back burner that I just don't even remember anymore. So that'll so. probably just go away <laughs> if we do. Even if we do, it's yeah. yeah this, this is this the is, next one to come this out. This needs to, this yeah. is yeah. way more relevant than yeah. what's going on right now. I think it was just freaking out and murmuring and doing dumb shit before your shirts. Our, oh. <laughs> shirts and bracelets coming in. Yep. 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 Shirts, bracelets. We're working on a few other things, so just be on the lookout. Be on the, the Jesus. <laughs> oh God. So as you guys can see, we're currently playing darts today. Yeah, let's uh, we're show fun with it. All right, so I've I'll got drop the one. unicorn darts. Hopefully, the frame there. I was like, I'm just gonna do the smart thing. Use the. Oh, there dart you go. Cam. That's smart. Yeah. Dart cam. So, dart cam up here, guys. I don't know how well we you can see Austin this right now. with the uh, the jack of hearts. Jack queen the, king ace. The hearts. With the blue shaft and the black <laughs> weight <laughs> dick piece and <laughs> and, needles, and uh, you can see how pointy they are. They're very pointy. <laughs> you're close. <laughs> <laughs> All there right. we go. Is that it? Yeah, you're good. <laughs> A pointy. <laughs> then you've got my unicorn darts with the black shaft. America's better. <laughs> America darts. America. Uh, for those listening, I have some basic ass shit, so <laughs> I don't care to show shit. you. Well, you'll know, be able to figure out which one's which. They're unicorn. Bro, brand. it says unicorn. They're unicorn brand. <laughs> They're unicorn brand darts. Unicorn brand. Unicorn. Hold on, I'm sorry. If there's anybody listening to this, like interference, my ASMR microphone bro. came I off. I should be able to cut it out. So ASMR, uh, wait. It's gonna go. Wait. Wait. <laughs> I'm not getting enough fixed. Oh god. Yeah, it's like so difficult to do myself. <laughs> While they're working on that, uh, we have been working on solidifying our playing on our five songs we played at the show, and we are working on another song, which is very fun. Yes. Uh, we're calling it Panic cool. as of now. We should definitely make stick with that. Part in. Um, <laughs> but Austin, Austin can probably explain a little bit better. We're trying to get into like polyrhythmic sound. How convenient, like Austin's mic should be back now. Yeah, I am actually now mic back up. And 
I want to hear Casey's explanation. I, I'm not even going to try. So <laughs> I, I've gone over, over it with everybody a few times. Um, if, you, if you're, you know, a big musician fan or just a big music fan in general and you know a lot about music theory, you know what polyrhythms, like, can do, I guess. Um, <clears throat> whether or not you know what they actually are, it's basically where you play, where one instrument plays one-time signatures, such as the drums play an 8-8 eight, eight, and the guitar starts playing a 5-8. And the bass would then follow the guitar, which creates this really interesting sound. Those were nice shots, man. Thank you. <laughs> it creates this really interesting sound, and it's honestly just a, it's just fantastic. Um, we will it's... be releasing a song eventually, hopefully, with those polyrhythms on it. We're working on it right now. I'm not going to talk too much into it just because I don't want to. Yeah, I don't want to reveal too we, much just we're now. We're trying but... to put it on the album. It will be on the album, that's, yeah. and possibly possibly a single release. Yep. We'll, but and on, we'll, the, on the flip side of things, with what we've already worked on, yeah. we're trying to get Apocalypse like recorded, pushed out, the whole shebang. Yeah. So oh. that's, been, that's been fun. I mean, Another pretty, thing, Daniel and I switched instruments. Thing. Yeah, oh, that's a good. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Daniel and I got a whole new instruments. I, yeah. I now have a seven-string Schechter Damien. Woo. And I have a six-string Ibanez. And we have basically re-tweaked all of our songs to have that just genty mathcore, almost like metalcore, mathcore, Christian rock, mathcore, death metalcore. <laughs> Just any just genre you can name, any any core, any genre you can name. Germanian manicore. <laughs> <laughs> but that's some of our biggest too. announcements. So um, I'm gonna let somebody else explain the rules of darts. I'm that trying to make an impromptu we're windscreen. Just, listen, we're not fucking playing. Darts okay. To play darts. We're okay. Well, just throwing it shit at the board. All right. Well, that's. We're out then, practicing. I'm we're saying we could do like money. a 21 or something simple then. Ooh. Hey, your boy made a windscreen out of his nice. hat. <laughs> I could tell the noise was getting rough on that, so. Yeah. If all that beginning part was just audio for me and Austin's mic, that'll be interesting. <laughs> I'm pretty loud, so. Yeah, that's true. Yes, and I think we can also say that we're working on uh, getting everything recorded in a timely manner for an EP release as well. Yep. I'm excited. Life Apocalypse is coming along. My slime, you got the darts. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Get behind the line of the shoes, AKA the shoe line. How's everyone feeling after after playing your guys' first show? Uh, it was pretty, I literally don't remember anything that happened. <laughs> so, I was like fully, I was- Like in the zone, right? Like, yeah, I was like so in the zone. The problem was, is I, I was so, I was nervous when we got there. We like set up all the sound equipment and stuff, and then we, what, what was it, two or three bands played before us? And yeah. We played yeah, three bands. And as we were like setting stuff up on the stage, I forgot how to play drums entirely, like 100% <laughs> forgot. And then Austin started playing, and I was like, oh, I remember every single thing that we've practiced. <laughs> um, so that was that was nice. Uh, and we, I mean, we killed it. it I think I would agree with that same feeling. And it, I mean, it was me and Casey's first time playing metal nice. music in oh, front of a live audience. Oh shit, nice. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Still pretty solid. I'm not gonna lie to you, it was a little surreal being the one to open our whole set with like the guitar yeah, yeah. That, that was off. that was really that was really that was really fun i really enjoyed doing that what? and i think i want somebody else to start it next time like <laughs> one of you two so that you guys can feel it the Get same the way same, like, yeah. it's just it's so it's being able to start that entire set you set the entire pace for everything it just yeah. felt so great and oh, i like oh, yeah. shout out Good job, great job to Riley on running sound. Yes, yeah. Thank you, I appreciate 100%. that. That was, that was my first time doing a big sound gig like that too, and it was fucking fun, honestly. Yeah, it turned out, the amount of people that said it was way better than last year was. Yeah, that felt great. That was, that was a lot of people. And it, yeah. it came to the point where like towards the last couple bands, I was just vibing, I was drinking a beer or two, and just having a great time, man. Yeah. Trying to wind filter up like, a little bit. I don't know if it's yeah, do, do what you gotta do. I have a little foamy piece on mine at least. You do look like Justin Timberlake though. Yeah.
Yeah. Totally. <laughs> Here, let me hit the let me hit the camera real quick with a. I mean, look at him. Look at he's got the he's got the oh, Britney yeah, Spears. Wait, is that Justin Timberlake? Oh my God, it's Justin Timberlake. Oh my God, Justin Timberlake. Oh, he's going. You don't know Bye Bye Bye? <laughs> yeah, that ramen, ramen hair. JT, bro. Holy Thank moly. you. Bye 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 bye. So yeah, so they've got new instruments. I got a very cute little bell. Yeah. I got a synthesizer that yeah. we're gonna yes. try to incorporate at least into the background for now. Yeah. As and a track of some sort. I started trying to play a little bit guitar. Yes, so, Peter. Yeah. Lots of new stuff going on in our world. Riley just almost broke. Almost just died. Um, <laughs> Whole leg almost broken. Yeah, we're excited for the stuff that's coming down the pipe right now. Very excited. Oh goodness gracious. There's a lot going on in Air to the Crown's world, but also at the same time, you can see we're just taking the nice little relaxing break. Yeah. yeah. Well, make sure, make we sure haven't put a lot of stuff out there, so I felt like we all kind wow. of agreed, like, crap, we need to get a podcast together. Yeah. And then the video idea was like, oh, let's push it a little further and see if we can do it. Okay, yeah, yeah that sounds fun. Yeah, just a fun idea. Yeah. But make sure you guys are, like, following us on all our social media and stuff for updates on merch and shows. Yeah, and when new stuff yeah, comes 100%. out. And we appreciate all this, the support of it. Absolutely. Um, and shout out to my dad for letting us use this space, space, to yep. practice and play around and have fun. Hey, if we manage to gain any newcomers to the podcast from uh, the show, and we're just now putting one out, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but thank you for yeah, listening. Shout out to all the bands that were at Hawesville. Oh, yeah. dude, that was amazing. Every single person killed it. Yep. It literally we started out. The first Brandon Beard started us off, nope. and he broke a string, and then took a fireball shot in the middle of his set. It was, the, it was, the it was so hard, shit. dude. We were like, if this isn't the most metal shit I've ever seen. Yeah, he oh, broke dude. a string, stopped, restrung his guitar while I played like one song over like, the PA. He was like, hey, uh, if you guys give me like five minutes, I can check yeah. this out. We were like, yeah, dude. Well, and then I started the the song, and he looked at me. He's like, you cut me off. I'm like, no, 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 go like fix your guitar. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted something to fill, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, oh, okay, cool. <laughs> Yeah, he was a super he, cool He dude. was a great start yeah, to that everybody, whole thing. Yeah, everybody that was there was well, Let's see if we can recount at least cool. most of them. I think we can knock it out together. So, Brandon Beard. It's not going to be in order, but I'm going to try. Brandon Beard. Tim Moretis. Tim Moretis. I don't think that's... I, still Cause think we, that's I think we missed one person. Oh, okay. That, anyway. Yeah. No, I know because... Oh, that's right. That's right. It's, Two yeah. of the bands dropped out. Brandon yeah. Beard, Tim Moretis, Us. Uh, <laughs> Symphony of Heaven. Yeah. After us was, or after Symphony of Heaven was Blood Tribe, Insectriarchy, Insectriarchy, Blood Tribe, Malignant Vision, Eye, Eye of Malice. Malice. There you go. Yeah. Yep. And there wasn't a band that I was not ahead of that either. So. Dude, I'm. Yeah, <laughs> it don't matter. I mean, it's, yeah, it doesn't matter. They don't know. Type it on your phone and show me, and then I'll <laughs> confirm. Oh, um. Holy. Yeah, we it just we'll leave it vague, but I mean we have a next show we're trying to work on. No idea how fast or slow it's gonna be. Bare minimum, I think we're trying to get it in January at some point. Worst case, so obviously same deal. Just follow us and check out uh, you know our socials for updates on that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. yep. Oh, darts! Yeah, we're playing darts. <laughs> we are playing darts. Yes. Okay, let's try to implement some sort of game to it, even if it's something simple. Oh, we're gonna come up with something on the block. Yeah, yeah, this makes it way funnier. All um, right, okay. so, so there's four playing, so I'm trying to figure out a way to incorporate your cornhole style. Like, if if I hit the same spot you do, then we're both zeroed out. You know what I'm saying? You're giving a lot of credit to us <laughs> being able to hit <laughs> shit. That's true. Um, <laughs> but but yeah. I mean, even on coincidence, you know. We could literally just do three or four rounds and just do like also um want to shout score. out randy riley's mom oh yeah for sure uh, yeah for going with us and being a trooper through that yeah and, just uh, the biggest fan we appreciate you yeah van paul sure. showed up too van paul yes. was i saw van paul's beard and i was like he's here yeah <laughs> ajax and amy both came yes my absolutely. aunt and uncle that was great yes they hung out for a while I will say one of the highlights for me was meeting Insectriarchy and like befriending yeah. them. Just like I said, we don't want to say anybody was oh, better boy. than anybody else, but those Insectriarchy guys were really cool people. Yeah, they were <laughs> fun to hang out with for sure. They, I love when <laughs> I love we were playing and then out of nowhere 
I just heard somebody yell, Daniel! <laughs> like, as we were playing, and all the Insectary Arky dudes were just, like, standing on uh, in the crowd oh, yeah, we and just yelling roll. the word Daniel. So, I actually, I want to go ahead and speak to a story that happened, Michael, that Michael recounted yes. while we were playing our last uh, song, Wasted Life. Yes. Uh, he said what he was, he was just sitting there, and he was like, all right, yeah, I'm going to jump up and down, have a good old time. And then right as the breakdown drop was hitting mm -hmm. and we do this little bend down to come back up into the like into the actual breakdown. Yeah. Uh, Michael said that he looked over and just all the guys from Insectiarchy just <laughs> swarmed right him. Yeah. <laughs> and he was just he was just in like an eight, nine person pit, like just immediately instantly. engulfed in a pit, yeah, essentially. That was super sick. And it was really cool because we were like it was really exciting for us because like especially for me, like because we got one like the first and one of the biggest pits there. Yeah. Let's open up this pit. Uh. And like, and Casey just stands up in one of the songs and goes, fucking move. <laughs> that was pretty amazing. That was uh, the beginning of Apocalypse that I said that and I meant it. And they did. And they did. And they did. They did not disappoint. Yeah, that was great. It, just, it was a really, Jessica made a comment that I agreed with wholeheartedly. It was a really good time of a bunch of metal bands enjoying each other play. Yep. So like there was a couple outsiders yeah. there and family that kind of stuff. But a lot of the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> okay, a lot of the crowd was just other metal bands, so we were all just gigging out. Don't, don't hold on. How did you one up my shitty throws? What the? You fuck? broke the. the th <laughs> no. I'll fix your dart here. Rest in peace. He broke the flag. Hey. Oh no, our table. It's broken. <laughs> <laughs> Rip. Oh man, that's so fucking funny. Holy shit. There you go. Oh uh, man. They braided stuff out of the out of frame, hopefully. That was wild. Yeah, we're all gonna be out of frame. Oh no! I'm in frame, check me out. I think my favorite part was what I was thinking about before we got to you was the fact that I got to play your guys' first show as a group with you. Yeah, for sure. Because I mean, you guys, you know, tried working in high school and stuff like that. Yeah. Video, videos of that just resurfaced. Um, yeah, we'll have to, oh my God. we'll have to get some of that out there at some point. I, I think it's fair to say, Riley, edit in. I 100% forgot that your hair was tied black. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> dude, I, Dollar Tree box hair dye all the time black, dude, like full I on. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. I yeah. Almost, um, I, I also remember when he died. At the end of this video, blood. we'll put some pictures from then and oh maybe, God, maybe a video clip. Casey, you remember when he dyed his hair blonde? Yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. That was real bad. <laughs> I might hit up the blonde again eventually. Don't do it. <laughs> he said, it don't, don't do it. it. <laughs> Hold on to it. Wow, I'm really bad. <laughs> Did I just go through there? No, it's sideways. Oh. Okay, that's weird. See, do you guys like. When I throw, I try to like spin the dart too. Well, you all, it like does it because of the fletching. Gotcha. Okay. The fletchling. The fletchling. <laughs> the fletching. Damn, Pokemon. Damn Pokemon guys. He said, "Oh no, I can't throw this dart because of the talent plane." <laughs> He's one of them Pokemans. I did want to mention on the merch again. Go back to that. Say we should hopefully have that within the next few, within the next like month or so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. No. Yeah, we've we've literally got an order. They should be working on it. Or will we, we got our that? confirmation email from one. Yeah. Have we gotten our confirmation email about the the bands yet? The bracelets, rather. I don't know. We're gonna check right now. We're doing it live. We're doing it live. We're doing it live. Play Pokemon Unite with me at Mountain Man Jack. <laughs> Shut <laughs> <laughs> I'm better in. Oh, I promise I'm good. Just I trust promise, me. I promise I'm good. I'm trying to get to Masters. Just come with me. Let's go. We're going to get to Masters together. <laughs> also play with Daniel. He is at the manual. He's a Pikachu <laughs> is main. Is it for real at the manual? Yeah, it's, at, it's the manual. That's so sick. Oh, yeah, yep, mine's... Does I have two accounts. The manual? the manual? I have two accounts. So one, my like my main is Mountain Man Jack that I play with everybody on. But like it, I got to veteran, so I couldn't play with everybody on it. Yeah. Like on ranked, because you have to be a, you, you, if you you have to be at least great class to play with veteran. And we just like we just 
we just brought Daniel up to great class, so now I can play with Daniel again on ranked. Yeah! yeah. He's actually getting ready to hit expert here very soon. <laughs> I'm more than good. I'm great. Uh, no, hashtag not a sponsor. <laughs> yeah, not a sponsor oh, at all. Dude, I just wanted to dude. talk. I yeah, like. I fell in minute. love with this this little game over the last well, like. To be fair, couple. the day Pokemon Unite came out, we, we did a stream. Yeah, on. we streamed it. Like so, like we also got Which, trouble I have by the Switch for that. Of that. So little, listen, little fun we're fact. Waves, okay, we're waves, guys. Little fun fact: we actually got like in a, in a little bit of trouble with Twitch. Not really trouble, but they're like, you're not gonna get your affiliate if you're not well, music related. So and yeah, like, well, like essentially through using the distribution service we do for music we get Twitch affiliate, except you have to stream music. So like we have to play ourselves, stream ourselves playing music, that kind of stuff. We've talked about it, we're working on it, maybe stream practices, I don't know, but kind of another endeavor. So yeah. more than likely what, what we could end up doing for streaming games is we could just do an individual thing. Like well, and we can just, we can still stream games. It doesn't take it away by any means. Just your broad percentage has to be music. I've had some cool ideas with that that hopefully come to fruition. I mean, we got stuff we can, you know, attempt with that. I'd be down to stream. I, I never really like looked practice. at the shirt. That's sick as shit. <laughs> That's really dope. Yeah, it's just all pixelated. Oh yeah, I'd be down. I'd be down to stream some of our practice. Of of the songs that we played at the yeah. show, yeah. not necessarily. We don't want to release uh, anything before we've pretty much before we feel it. comfortable. Well, technically, it. Casey just released the name of the song. I mean, he did. Yeah. I, I did it earlier. He did it earlier. Oh, I didn't know. I, I said, well, I said what title. we're. I just said like right now we're calling it Panic. Because to be, doing. yeah, I mean, that's fair. How many of our songs have? I mean, that doesn't re that doesn't like give away anything I mean, about the song. You know, Waddle Dee stays the same. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we never changed it. Yeah, never, never totally doesn't have a name. <laughs> <laughs> wish you could waddle dee me now. Wish you could waddle dee me now. All right, that's waddle dee sounds like a Pokemon. It does. No, it's it's the thing from Kirby. What is it? It's the little so you know it's, the little basic enemy on Kirby. It's, it's like the little the little red. Gold, yeah, it's the little red like things with like little like one eye tan faces. No, no, it's not the one eyes. Oh, okay. That's that's um beam something. Uh, Oh my god, what are they called? No, Waddle Dee is the little it's the little thing that like runs around with King D to D. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like there's those little things. I love Waddle Oh, you're right. Okay, yeah, there's the two eyes. I got you. I'm also a huge Kirby nerd, obviously. Kirby nerd, Kirby nerd. Kirby alert. I'm actually considering naming my next dog Kirby. Name your next song Kirby? Next no, my next dog. dog. Oh, your next dog. I was like, why are we calling up this dog named Kirby? Um, How because many it sucks the soul Kirby out of you. Kirby related are we going to have? Doing, uh, it sucks the soul out of you when you listen to it, so we have to name it Kirby. That's not a bad idea. Yeah. Hold on, let him finish that one. <laughs> that was a spider web just floating. That thing was massive. Well, and actually, that brings up a good point. So he said, should we release a track list for the EP? Yeah, I mean, we can talk about that. The good point it brings up is, of what we played live, yeah. the soft song isn't going to be on the EP. Yeah. So, like, that's the yeah. thing, right, is yeah. we felt that it doesn't match the rest of it as well. So right we have that song, like... In our repertoire, but I don't think it's going to end up on the EP itself. So the EP, as it stands, then is going to be in whatever order. This is not necessarily a determined order. Um, Apocalypse. Wish you could see me now. Yep. An interlude featuring Band Paul, Lethal which mentality. we played live. Lethal mentality. Re-recorded. And wasted life. what? Wasted yeah, life. wasted life. What a wasted life. So. I'm super stoked to get all that stuff out there. And Apocalypse, I think we're gonna try to release first. I mean, that's why we're, you know, it's like a single kind of thing, which is why we are um, working on it right now. But I'm I'm way stoked about that. Well done. Well, <laughs> I I'd be down to do that, guys. If you ready to You're a music. Oh, well, is there anything you want to cover? So even the new. We've announced what we're after as far as that goes. You follow all of our shits as always. A couple new stuff in the works. Yeah. Um, oh God, I think that's it. I don't know. I think that's everything. I think that's it, boys. Any closing words? Daniel, you first. No, I just appreciate all the support we've gotten so far. I can't wait to see what we what we keep doing moving forward. Absolutely. Austin? Uh, again, Pokemon Unite, Mountain Man Jack, and the manual. <laughs> Hit us go. up. Uh, I am looking forward to trying to incorporate some synthesizer work. And that synthesizer has uh, like vocal input capabilities and vocoding and stuff. So 
That'd be pretty neat, Casey. Buy merch. When it, when do possible. It. We got you. We're gonna hit. We're gonna do know, it. You know, you better buy it. All right. Buy merch. Thanks for all the support, Thanks guys. Thanks for all the support, guys. We love you. Everybody's Mwah. loved. Mwah. 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 Hey guys. What's up? Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, we're back. <laughs> this uh little thing at the end here, real quick. <laughs> While we were recording, what you guys just watched and or listened to, um, we got a message from who was it? From our boy, what's from his name? Corbin. 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 Yes, um, from what Corbin. band? From Shockwave Theory. From Shockwave Theory. Shout out yep. Corbin. Asking if we could play a show on October 30th. 30th. The day before Halloween, day before Halloween. at the venue. At the venue. Halloween. So it's official. We're going to play at the venue October 30th. Um, and yeah. we, we had to just throw that in there real quick. We're all sweaty and gross from. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> we're all sweaty and gross from recording. Yeah. I mean, from uh, practicing. Right. And, and shout you know, out, shout out to Maria for actually getting back to it. You literally got back to us within like thirty, like minutes. immediately. Yeah, so awesome. it went from so, "Hey, could you possibly do this?" to within twenty minutes, "Yes, you're for sure like on the show." Being on the show, you, you know, can announce it. More. Yeah, so that's why we're throwing yeah. this together real quick. Yep. Thank you very much, and we hope to see you guys there. Take it easy. Bye guys. Thanks, guys. Woo!